and welcome back to Nonstop Wrestling Raw Part 3. Let's get things started. And Yuri Watson is coming to the ring. And let's see what Yuri Watson is, has in store for us tonight. I do know he's in a match at the moment, but we don't know whose opponent's going to be. Yuri has been... Well, he asked for a superstar last week and got the Mundo before the Mundo was traded. And, uh, well, he put up a good show, but didn't was defeated in the end. Let's see who Mr. Watson has in, st has in store for us tonight. Professor had very mixed results here in non-stop wrestling. And here is John Lawrence. Mr. Watson, I thought you would you might want to meet the patient you are facing tonight. So here's the newest signing for Raw, Curtis Barnett. Ooh, not too much known about this Curtis Barnett. Let's see. Who is our latest signing for Raw? We've had this is a fourth man tonight. Fourth new signing. The signings continue to grow. And here is Curtis Barnett. And well, a few things about Curtis. We know about, he's from Florida. He has been through the independent scene of wrestling and is now in non-stop wrestling. So let's see what he can do tonight. As it's coming up next, it is Yuri Watson taking on Curtis Barnett in his debut match on Raw. It should be very, very interesting, this one. It looks very focused for his first match. Let's see how he gets on. And we are underway. The Professor Yuri Watson versus Curtis Barnett. Our newest signing here. And straight away, taking down... Yuri Watson, is this going to be over straight away? Uh, Watson is struggling big style here. Curtis Barnett did not take any time. Look at this. Yuri Watson showing his ring presence. Big kicks to the back of the head. Just taking a breather. But look at that. Caught Curtis with a big swing and neck break. I'm sure Yuri Watson will want to show this rookie some of the ropes here at non-stop wrestling. Y Yuri Watson is a very tough individual as you see last week calling out anyone it takes a man with a lot of guts to do that watching getting back in now and Kurt is trying to fool him to come back out and there it is the chase is on Watson now back in again Kurt, Kurt is showing him trying to trick him and now it's Yuri Watson's turn to trick Curtis Barnett. This is Game of Camp Well, Look at that. Barnett had enough. Took the, the professor off his feet. Throws him back inside the ring. So, so far tonight, we know th the teams through to the next round of the tag team tournament. We have Money Club. We have the Usos. We have Kings of Wrestling. There are three teams f through so far. And the main event, well, that will be the, the, the last semi-final place. It'll be Langston and Russ versus Cajun White. What a chance for one of them teams to go on as well. So could, we could have a double champion in non-stop wrestling. So there you go. But that's coming up next as Watson in control here. Oh, big sit-out pile driver. Could that be enough to put Curtis Barnett away in his opening match? The professor into the cover gets only a one though. Barnett made a strain of stuff. Big punches, has him up, gets him down, and a kind of vice locked in. He had this early in the match. Is the, what, the professor going to be able to get out of it a second time? He looks in a lot of trouble and he has tapped. Curtis Barnett has won his opening match on Raw, his debut match. 
what a performance from Curtis Barnett. Locked it in. I thought it was over from here when it was just a sit-out. The sit-out powerbomb pile driver kind of move. And then Watson in, in trouble as soon as that kind of vice was locked in. Barnett locked it in and the professor had to tap. And that gives the victory to Curtis Barnett in his debut in his debut fight here. Well done to him. And he will move on. Surely to big and better things now in non-stop wrestling. Look out for him coming up in the next few weeks. Yuri Watson, he must think his luck is out after the last few weeks he's had here on Raw. But Curtis Barnett, a great opening performance. And I'm sure, as I said, we'll see a lot of things from him coming up on Raw. As we are backstage with Barnett, who's with um, Michael Cole. He's just went backstage. He says, it's your first match here on Raw. Curtis Barnett. And Curtis, how does it feel to be here on Raw? He says, I'm really glad to be here on Raw. I had a choice where to go, and this was the only show I wanted to be on. And now I'm, I'm here. The goal is simple, to show I am the best. Well, big claims from Curtis Barnett. Maybe we will see a lot of him in the coming weeks. He says, I'm not going to mess around here in non-stop wrestling. I want titles, and I want as many titles... Well, he wants many times in the start, and the start to that was tonight. Well, it is indeed a good opening performance from Curtis Barnett. Give him a lot of credit for the performance he's just put against Yuri Watson. We will see in the, the, the coming weeks what he will do. So, a new superstar is born tonight in Curtis Barnett. Coming up, it is your main event, Bray Wyatt and the... World Champion Daniel Cage, meeting the United States Champion Biggie Langston and Mr. Money in the Bank, Mark Russ. And remember, this now doubles up as the last semi-final place in the tag team tournament. So Daniel Cage, yeah, the World Champion, team up with Bray Wyatt. This put together by John Laurinaitis. White family, would have been interesting to see if the White family had qualified. And if Bray Wyatt and Daniel Cage had qualified, if they would have met each other. What would have happened? But it's not, as I say, Daniel Cage now. After what he did to Mark Rush tonight, I think that just a little bit paid him off, I think. So Daniel Cage will want to be in the careful of Mark Rush as here comes Bray Wyatt. None of the Wyatt family out with him. Very, very strange individual, this Bray Wyatt. We've seen the White family were not successful in their tag team match, the Fallen and Screwface. So a chance for really the leader of the White family, Bray Wyatt, to qualify on his own. But I wouldn't be surprised if in future weeks one of the White family was out with Bray. Very, very creepy individual, to say the least, is Bray Wyatt. And he will be teaming up with the world champion, Daniel Cage, tonight. Very interesting match made by John Laurinaitis. But as I say, Biggie Langston and Mark Russ will be their tag team opponents. And here is the United States champion, Biggie Langston. Has been so impressive. Got the win for the United States title back at Money in the Bank in the triple threat match with Matt Walker and Fandango and Biggie Langston has been wanting to get it back into action did so last week teaming up with Mark Russ so they'll do it again and what a team they were last week Cage refused to tag in Giant Limbo trying to think he was Big and clever. I'm sure he will get Bray Wyatt into this match. Tag team quarterfinal matches are now as. And you're coming up. It is Mr. Money in the Bank, Mark Russ. He has an opportunity to cash in on the world champion any time before November. And after what Daniel Cage done to him tonight, I'm sure we are going to see fireworks from Mark Russ tonight. He 
he will be not laying down for Daniel Cage. He tried to be friends with him, only be hit in the back with the tag with the World Championship. So Mark Russ, big bad mood tonight, and this is one person I would certainly not like to get on the bad side of. But it is Biggie Langston and Daniel Cage to start the match. It is United States Champion versus World Champion. And the United States Champion takes Cage down. Has Russ. Look at this. Oh, big power slam takes him down. They go behind on Cage. Summer Slam, remember, comes to you on Sunday the 14th make sure you join us for that so many titles on the line Edge versus Daniel Cage is your main event for the world title from the raw side Biggie Langston found out it'll be Sean Bethwick as he hits a flapjack on Daniel Cage is the new number one contender for his title we'll also see the tag team titles on the line so you, you could see Daniel Cage you could see sorry um, Daniel Cage or Biggie Langston doing double duty on uh, SummerSlam where they could have to fight twice if one of their teams make it to the final of the tag team competition. Wyatt now into the ring for the first time. Big punch to the arm. Always uh, moving on. Langston taking none of that with a big clothesline into the tie. with a bit of test of strength going on here. Wyatt comes out of it. Again, kick into the chest with a punch into the arm. And, but Langston again, not affected. Big belly, th belly suplex uh, throw, sorry. And look at this. Takes him down. Second, look at the power of this man. Takes him down. Three backbreakers in a row. No easy feat on Bray Wyatt, who is a big individual. Why now took a breather, come back in the ring, can feel the effects of the match. Langston has him up. Big ending time coming up already. He's calling for it. And there it is, the big ending. And this one is over, ladies and gentlemen, already. Into the cover. One no Langston. Well, didn't keep his shoulder. It was a bit of a lazy cover to be honest. Why managed to kick out? Why it now? Samoan drop takes down Biggie Langston and Daniel Cage is going to get tagged in here Lang but look at that Langston win doesn't even let him in the ring kicks him off and now both men fighting on the outside exchanging blows Langston th uh, throws Daniel Cage up the ring up, up the ramp sorry and the referee still counting out Daniel Cage here Daniel Cage thought about leaving just for a minute and then has decided he's going to start coming back down. Langston takes Bray Wyatt off the apron in the meantime. Very interesting to see if these teams qualify for the semi-final. Because with one champion on each side already, it would be very, very interesting. Also, you've got to think most of money in the bank. Mark Russ on the other side. He'll be thinking, well, if Daniel Cage has to fight twice at SummerSlam. Could he cash in money in the bank then? Wyatt now. Look at this. Samoan drop again on Biggie Langston. Driving the air out of him. What's, what is Wyatt doing here? He's going to the outside. Really not letting, giving Langston a chance to get up. Don't know if Wyatt was feeling the effects of something, but has got Langston to come out of the ring and then go back in. And again, Wyatt on the outside. Now called, Russ had enough of the game, threw him back inside. Langston trying to just stretch out a bit there. Now has Wyatt, throws him into the, the corner. Big clothesline coming out of it. And then drops the elbow down. Is that enough to put Bray Wyatt away? Referee, a little bit slightly out of position. Gets a one, that's all. So much coming to, some, coming to you on SummerSlam. Look at this. And again, a big back break. And a second. He's going to hang on for a third. 
the damage already being done to Bray Wyatt, but Bray Wyatt gets out the ring again before the pin was attempted. Looking to bring Daniel Cage back in the match, which he does. Daniel Cage will fight Edge. And look at this. Oh, Mark Russ tried to hit Bray Wyatt and was pushed back in to Biggie Langston. He was setting up for the big ending. That is give Daniel Cage the chance to get back into this match. I think Bray Wyatt moved, successfully moved out of the way and got Daniel Cage out of that move. And then Langston hung up on the top rope. Look at this. And Cage with a splash off the top. My goodness, this is totally turned around. Langston trying to fight both men here. Gets Wyatt back in the ring, but he's not the legal man. It is Daniel Cage who is. Cage has managed to get um, Langston back into the ring. And with a big boot to the face. Remember, this is the fourth quarter-final match of the tag team title tournament. Langston's had some time to recover and gets Russ back into the ring. L Cage doesn't see Russ getting back in. And then, well, I thought he was going to be called then, but he manages to kick Russ into the boot. But look at this. Russ drops Cage down for the backbreaker. And this is what Cage has wanted all along. Daniel Cage on the own, on his own. Now on the outside. Cage thrown back inside by Biggie Langston. So much happened tonight here on Raw. Seen four new signings for Raw. Christian, the Usos, Curtis Barnett have now all joined the Raw brand. We've had Money Club, the Usos, and and the Kings of Wrestling. They're the three through. The team's through for next week's semi-finals. Who's going to be the fourth and to join them? Cage, if you're looking for a tag there. Why it went off to try and help him and it wasn't back in time. Russ throws Cage over the top rope. What a main event we've had so far here on Raw. Mark Russ hit on the back of the head with a title earlier on this evening by Daniel Cage. Again, Daniel, Daniel Cage getting Russ to come to the outside. Riot, Riot again throws him back inside. And Russ is now concentrating more on Bray Wyatt than he is Daniel Cage, which isn't a good thing. And it seems to be like trying to get a hold of him. And now he has. He now he has Daniel Cage the way he wants him. Throws him back inside the ring. Russ, the big boot into the midsection. Gets it, throws Daniel Cage into his corner. And Biggie Langston has a little bit of time to have recovered. Look at this. What is this? Oh my goodness, what a move that is! Sort of a knee of jumping over, it hits the knee. Is that enough to put down the kid away? No, it's just a one. That, what a tag team move that is. Langston and Russ doing really well over the last few weeks, but look at this. Of them t oh, and a 3D! But Langston didn't sell it, I don't think he, he, they got it all. Cage thought he had it. Langston just popped up out of it. Gets now right wide into the cover. And it's a three. And well, did Biggie Langston pull the wool over the eyes of Daniel Cage? I think what happened is if you turned around for the 3D, he, he caught Bray Wyatt and then Wyatt got up, hit him with a big clothesline. And Daniel Cage thought that they were, his team were going to win. And Biggie Langston has turned this round. And Biggie Langston and Mark Russ, now watch this, from the 3D... I don't think he's seen out the picture, but he, Biggie Langston didn't get caught with it. And then the clothesline was enough to put Bray Wyatt away. And Biggie Langston has pulled the wool over the eyes of Daniel Cage here. And he's got the win for his team, and that is going to make Mark Russ... Well, after the night Mark Russ had, after being hit with the title, I am stunned with that. But congratulations to Biggie Langston and Mark Russ. They qualify for the semi-finals next week. And, well, what will be in store for Raw next week? You will have to find out. Surely Daniel Kidd will want to respond. But that is it for Non-Stop Wrestling Raw this week. Until SmackDown, it's beautiful Dave Easton saying goodbye. <laughs>